According to a new report, RCMP officers were given permission to break the law a record number of times in 2017. For more on this story, we're joined by RCMP Sergeants Lewis and McMahon. How many times do RCMP officers get permission to break the law in an average year? Six. And how many times did it happen in 2017? 73. Yeah. 73 times. Yes, sir. And guess who was responsible for two of those times? <laughs> You're looking at him. <laughs> you two both had permission to break the law last year. What laws did you break? Can't say. It would compromise an undercover agent who looks a lot like me, but with an eye patch. <laughs> Under what sort of circumstance would an officer get permission to commit a crime? Well, hypothetically, if an officer was uh, deep undercover as a tribute in a motorcycle gang, part of his initiation was to assassinate a member of a uh, rival gang. No fair! All I got to do was run an illegal bookkeeping operation. <laughs> hypothetically. And how does it feel to break the law as police officers? Mm -hmm. Well, <laughs> you get that little rush of excitement like when you're doing something you shouldn't be doing. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, uh, Mm, you're kind of out of bounds, you know? Even though you have permission, you, you know you're being bad. Oh, yeah. If I didn't know better, I'd say you both take a sort of colonel pleasure in this. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's messed up. Well, we didn't get to be cost by being well-balanced humans. Anyway, look, we gotta run. I'm expected back to the Hells Angels compound. I mean, church. <laughs> <laughs>